Hello, 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 hello. Hold on. I... The reason, the, the, there is a reason why I haven't been here for a very long time, or streamed for a very long time, and that's because I've been playing Minecraft the entire time, and I didn't, I just, I don't know, I just didn't feel like streaming. So instead of Minecraft, I mean, I do have stuff to do in Minecraft, but I wanted to play Honkai Star Rail again. I played like a little bit, a, a little bit of streams of me starting it and okay hold on i didn't know this was gonna happen i played a little bit of it like like the intro I, i'm still at the intro i didn't finish the entire or not the entire game but i didn't i'm not in like i'm starting a new save or whatever <clears throat> like i i was on, i'm still on the spaceship part i think I don't know where that is or how that is, but I'm still there. Well, I don't remember, so that's why I'm starting all over again. That's why it might be too loud. Hold on. Like, I was watching some other streamers play the game. I was like, well, I want to play it too. So I... So, so now I'm playing it. Still downloading resources. It, it won't take that long, but it, it probably won't take that long. I, I play on the laptop. I mean, it's not bad, but it's probably worse than what other people have. Like some stuff. I thought I thought they wait. Okay, I thought they wanted me to uh, like restart the entire game, but they didn't. Okay, is it, is it starting? I don't know if it's starting. I don't know. I might be too loud. I can turn myself down, so I probably should. It's like, it's in the red, and I don't like that. Being in the red is not good. Also, I think the audio needs to be a bit louder. I, I did the audio before I started the game. That's why it was a bit lower than before. It wasn't loud. And that's a problem I had when I first started the game, was that the game was really loud. But yeah, I also wanted to play the game because I was watching streamers or I was watching other VTubers play the game and I got rewards out of it and I was like, well, I, I want to get the rewards, so I got the, I'm got i getting the rewards after I play the game. Just not now because I need a character. Okay, the game might be too loud. It's not that loud. I think the cutscene just loud. Ellie always tells me best future. So what's with the explosion just now? Was that also part of the script? Uh huh. Twenty three forty four fifty nine sixty five. It's almost the next day. The explosion caused a massive breakdown from the master control system. You did that. No, the antimatter legion did it. They completely invaded the space station two system hours ago. So do we need 
need to fight the Legion. I don't know. Eleanor didn't say anything about it, so it doesn't matter. Got it. So from now on, I'll be in charge of this operation. Copy. Can you let me have some fun next time? Our last few operations turned out to be pretty dull. I'm sorry. I'm afraid there is not much I can do for you. Our task this time is just to place the target properly. But if you want to go look for some fun yourself, I won't stop you. I mean, after all. <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Q for a single attack. Do I get the pick? Oh, I do get the pick. Okay. I did it. I, I got I, I won my first battle. Okay. I don't get the keeper though. She's a, she's a, she, I'm only getting her because I can't play my character. Is it Herta? Herta? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she looks so young. She was already famous in the last Amber era. No. She has to be at least a hundred years. She's a hundred. Uh, do they know this is a game? I don't know. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Papers covered in math lie scattered on the table. The author seems to left in a free. Don't need a space to. Okay. Is there anything else? Boxes? I can only do those two while in. I don't know. When did the anti-matter legion become so weak? Oh, she got a phone. Hold on, I just want to turn up. Voice. Voice sound effects. Music can stay at like two. Only it attracts this much. Did you really want the entire legion to come here? This lot won't be able these to slow people? down the Astro Express crew. You know, no, I don't really care about these people. I mean, her is pretty cool, but I don't know about those guys. Enemy is now within the range or within the character's attack range. Got him. I blast. No, never mind. No blasting. Never mind, I can. Now I can bolt, or not blast them, but I could use my ultimate. Good times never last. Space. Time to say bye. She's pretty cool. I'm gonna have to roll for her though. I, that's why I, I don't know why, but I really like uh, gotcha games. Damn. Cleaning up other people's mess isn't in my job description. You know, Kafkai. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Where did you send it, Silverwolf? Some random coordinates. Not important. You care about where that Void Ranger ended up? 
Of course not. I'm just amazed that this fancy technique of yours is usual. <laughs> just a little trick of tampering with the data of reality. I wouldn't call it fancy. What were you looking at so intently just now? Let me see. Herta's toys. A catalog featuring the space station's collection of rare items. They've got a lot of interesting gadgets. Let me go get one of those. Like what? There's this gun. It can rate any creature within its crosshair as a score from 0 to 100. Uh, doesn't sound very interesting. That sounds useless. What? <laughs> Aren't you curious about how much you would score? I kind of want to know mine. Fine. Well, you're a creature? Swing by and play with it if it's not too far. What's our destination? Wait, what are we even... Actually, never mind. Behind the door on the left. There's a room where some kind of rare item is stored. And so that's where the Stellaron is. That's where we can find out where the Stellaron is. Let's go play with some gun or something. She <laughs> sounds like... <laughs> they gotta switch the other character so I can pick up stuff from the table. She's she's too short. Emergency evacuation. There's gotta there gotta be some secrets here. There can't be just nothing. Yeah, some credits or whatever. Never mind. I, I went through there already. This this gotta be some. This is this is a, this is a box. Stellar Jade. Is having fun breaking things. She did say she wanted to have fun. Or the other girl. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Just like a little spin. I think I don't know. Of the space station is up ahead. There will be lots of Legion Void Rangers there. Okay. I'm pretty sure single attacks are probably more better than blast attacks. That's 31 damage. <laughs> Uh, I can use the media lead. Okay. Impair. Oh, he killed him. Okay. I unlocked tutorials. Is that it? That's all I need to know? That's how you play the game? Something is up ahead. There's a guy. No, there's an ambush. Looks like we're the ones getting ambushed. But they're the ones getting besieged. That breathing sensation. Remember it. Skill points is a combat resource. Oh, use the skill points just doing uh more enemies. This okay. I used to use the special attacks. May as well kill them all. Oh, I can do it again. Well, maybe I should, because it's three people. Just like that. It's like maybe she does more damage when she uh she does the Oh well, of course she does because it's um because it's a special attack. Time to say bye. Not a single soul here. Impressive evacuation work. Did Herta organize it herself? 
According to the access history, she hasn't logged in here for over six months. The evacuation was directed by the Asta researcher, a girl named Asta. That doesn't ring a bell. Oh, right. Elio said we wouldn't run into her to... Seems she really isn't here. Oh, uh, maybe she's hiding somewhere. Well, Where's the Stella? never mind. Elio's script doesn't include any info about the location of the Stellaron, which means in the future he foresees... We would find the Stellaron in a non-physical way. This space station is packed with extraordinary objects. I wouldn't be surprised if there's one that can make it happen. Well, hiding something extraordinary with something extraordinary. This is pretty Herta. I assume you know what to do. I mean, you've read the catalog for quite a while. I've got all the clues we need. The only piece missing is a simple trick. Help me investigate the terminal in this room. Our item might be inside. Okay. The stage is yours. Oh. Is she like... Oh yeah, she's there. I was like, I can't play as her. I was gonna play as her. Huh? I can't yeah. see the memory storage for this terminal. This is the monitoring room. They must have deleted the records and made a run for it. Classic. There's only two things I have to look at. I can see the whole space station on the surveillance screen, but not the Stellaron. Even if you could, <laughs> it'd be a trap. Herta doesn't display her collection. <sighs> Make your way over here, then. There's no point in trying to search like this. Okay, then what's this then? You know what that is? So, it's a t the that TV. a matter of hacking the surveillance system directly. She's not even moving her mouth. Ah, I see. Herta's collections aren't in the system, so anything unaffected should be our target. I'm not even moving my mouth either. They're just telepathically talking. Somehow she did that. She's just standing there. Simple, crude, but effective. Look, found it. Interact with the curio to unravel the secret in the monitoring room. There's a secret What's here. This? Item number 211. Blind spot. A simple light deflecting field. It allows an object in its field to pass unnoticed. But if a different item ceases to be obvious, the object gets revealed. So, Herta hides her collection with something as simple as this? The simplest method is the hardest to spot. Isn't that our motto? Oh, that... wait. Oh, what the... what, is the TV not real? Strange thing number two. The data suggests it's just an ordinary hologram. But if... Let's take a look. Oh, I didn't... I didn't... Don't worry. I didn't let that play. This won't be our grave. Wait, you wanna hear it? You can hear it. Hologram, but it, has it has an added layer. <laughs> Interesting. She's a member of the Genius Society, all right. The Stellaron is a. <sighs> yeah, I got it, or something. System. I guess even for her, the Stellaron is no ordinary rarity. Can you get it? Of course. Go grab Even it. The genius Herda can't compete with me when it comes to hacking. Good. Then I'll also count on you with the preparation of the receptacle. <laughs> oh, she really just did and go and grab it. <laughs> said this decision will bring about lots of changes. He also said, it must be you who makes it. Want to give her a new name? Hmm. There you go. It's me. <laughs> but I look there different. Or whatever. How much 
does she remember? Hmm. I'll remember you. Oh, she's she's putting something in me. Hey, who the fuck are you? I thought you'd remember me. Maybe you're not as important as you think. Okay, that was a joke. Listen, you are in a daze right now. You don't know who you are, why you're here, or what you're going to do next. You think I look familiar, but you're not sure if you should trust me. None of that matters. All you need to know is that I'm leaving. And you will be left That's me. all alone on this space station. From now on, you needn't think about your past or doubt yourself. Listen, in the near future, you will encounter all kinds of perils and hardships. Oh, thank you for the follow. You will also have many wonderful experiences. Oh, and grave, bro. Who will treat you Hi. Like family and embark on what, what is she talking about? <laughs> A bit of a in a bit of a daze. And troubles you will resolve. Yeah, I, I wanted to play the game after watching some other streamers play, and then it's like, oh, I also get rewards for watching people play. <laughs> so like, okay, well, I'm playing the game then. Uh, this is your future that Elio has foreseen. Do you like it? What? I get friends? No, I don't want it. I guess. Lovely. Well, I, I played the game like a bit ago on stream. I in I didn't get really far and then I wanted to play it again. Because you know I was like, oh, I want to play a game like this. The of your story. And then I think more recently it's because I was watching other people play it. I was like, oh, I want to play it now. That's the you I like. <laughs> How long do you think you need? According to the script, the Astral Express crew is arriving soon. We should avoid being seen by them. I know, Silver Wolf. Just give me another minute. Just some random ass person. I must leave now. Don't worry, someone will come and find you very soon. Just go with them. You won't remember a thing except me. When you have a chance to make a choice, Make one that you know you won't regret. Wait, I have to make choices already? Oh damn, they're going somewhere. Oh, didn't they have to like plant something or something? I don't know where they're going. Okay, time to make some friends. I wonder if they have, uh, I don't know if they have different races or species. I don't know. It is, it is like a space game. Do they have like space CPR? Why, why? Name's uh my name is Kafka. Oh, this isn't good. Let's go Maybe refer to the the only sure name that you know. Remember your name. <laughs> nice to meet you. My name's Don Hung. And this is March seventh. This space station was just attacked by the antimatter legion. We came to help with the rescue at the request of lead researcher Asta. Okay. Oh yeah, what is the antimatter lesion? You're lucky the most dangerous Lord Ravager among them isn't around. Just some nasty minions. The Enemenator of Destruction. That's who he is. Except he's not here though. No, we? I mean, we. Uh -huh. I'm part. I okay. Petite cutie with pink hair. Madame Herda appointed her to be the acting lead researcher. 
That girl really needs to step up. I can't believe her own employee doesn't even know her name. Oh, I I was supposed to know who that. Okay. Back to the master control zone. Ask then the other researchers have gathered there. Plus, that's where we parked the Astral Express. Don't you worry. We'll protect you from the monsters and clear up this mess. Hey, who the hell are you guys? Are members of the Astral Express crew. Well, the Express has some dealings with Madame Herta. So we come to visit the space station from time to time. We just so happen to arrive during this invasion. Of course, as a <coughs> crew of heroes, we're happy to lend a hand. Yeah, you've never seen it? The Express comes here every once in a while. It's a unique train that can travel between the stars with the power of the Trailblaze Eon. I'll show you once we're back to the Master Control Zone. Okay. I got some train. You and March go back together. Uh, okay. Our land from the security department lost contact in the vicinity. I need to find him first. Oh, all right. You stay safe. Yeah, what are, what are we supposed to do? Oh yeah, we're also we're fighting the invasion, I, I guess. are rampaging through the space station like a pack of wolves this trip won't be a walk in the park it's better if you have something to protect yourself just a suggestion though you're safe as long as you stick with me so i don't have to get it is that what you say open the character menu to view information that's oh it's old right Left alt. Oh, or you can just press it too. Wait, no, no, I, I think it's to activate the mouse. Okay, never mind. I'm a physical. The path of destruction. What is she? Preservation? Isn't. It... <laughs> so, like, the opposite. I get a bat. I wonder if you. I don't. Actually, I don't think you do. I don't think you get any other different, like, weapon. You need to keep the bat. Space anchor. Oh, that's where you pick characters. The joy filtration set. Everybody owns owns one. What's that? This is her collection, right? Oops. What did, what did what did she say? I didn't hear what she said. I I cut her off by looking at something. Oh, is this the raiding pistol? Oh, I have 84 points. Enough dilly dallying. We gotta go. No. <laughs> it's a, a conch. Okay. I guess we can go now. This took a took a computer. Uh, it's the antimatter legion. So these crazy jerks. I got him. Let's see what she what can she do? Weakness type. Okay. Use ice attacks and flick weakness break, causing enemies to freeze. Physical attacks and flick weakness. Okay. That means our duel right here is already really good then.
I think she gave it to herself. My turn. Do a blast. It doesn't skip their turn? I thought it would skip their turn. It didn't skip any of their turns. Also, she has the fence, so she's not gonna... She's not gonna die easily. Okay. Let's make it quick. Take this. Battle over. You're stronger than you look. You seem to be quite the fighter. Yeah. I know how to use a bat. I don't have axes. Okay. I'll go I'll go the other way then. We need to get to that. It looks like an elevator. I think that is an elevator. Never mind. On the central platform to go down to the master control zone. Do you know the way? Yes. I noticed that you're not wearing the space station staff uniform. Do you really work here? I don't remember. You must have been injured. Never mind. I won't ask if you don't want to talk about it. Let's go. I'll take you to the safe zone. It was an option work, but it just said nothing. That, that'd be a, a little bit scary in in her situation. <laughs> like, where you don't look like you're supposed to be here. Like, what are you supposed to? What are you? What are you doing here? And then they just don't say anything. Oh. Okay, they're weak to both of us. Oh, 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 oh! He missed. Oh, I'm locked on. Everybody's gonna fight me. So I, yeah, I should do that to myself. Right there while I give you a present. Let's go. Rules are made to be broken. We <laughs> don't even know who the hell I am, but I don't know, I'm pretty cool. You know, partly, like, one of the reasons why I really wanted to play the game was because... Oh, it's being reduced. It's because they have... I, I really like the visuals in this game. The visuals are really cool to, to watch. Like, I've seen some of the cutscenes, the, the newer cutscenes, and I was like, whoa, I really want to play this game. <laughs> and it's all... and it's a free game, too, so... Uh, yeah. Got protein rice. Space anchor. You can't go to that area. Can't go to that area either. Is that all? Uh, I knew it. It doesn't work. Wait, then why why are you saying that? <sighs> Too bad Don Hung's not here. He's like a walking encyclopedia. He knows a ton of complicated stuff. Maybe even elevator repair. Uh, I don't know that one. He doesn't know elevator repair? <sighs> why are you here? And how did you get here before us? I took another route to the upper level, and I saw you guys from up there. Arlan is in the control room. He's been injured, but not fatally. You found him. Will he know what to do about this elevator? Yeah, does he know elevator I stuff? I suppose as the head of the security department, he should know. I don't think so. Let's go talk to him. I got him. I didn't get a crazy visual like that. 
March 7th, they get a crazy visual like that. Yes, let's get Dong Hung. Tread carefully. He looks like a pretty cool character. <laughs> I level him up. Oh. Not that much. I should level up all my characters. What level are you I I don't know where to look. We're level four. Oh wait, I know where to look. The level two. No, oh, you know what? Never mind. Uh, I'll just keep it that way. <laughs> I don't know he's pretty smart. He should be. He should be a bit, a bit more leveled than both of us. Oh, it's because she can shoot. Okay, it's like she can do long range, long range stuff. Like he has both single tar targets. Let's take out this guy. Like he's gonna come back. Oh, I did not. I'm pretty sure I could have hit like three guys, but I didn't do it right. Oh, that's not good. You never, you never want them to attack the archer. And this guy looks like the fighter in the group, so I want to take him out quickly. You have the worst luck running into right there while I give you a present. Rules are made to be broken. Oh, so I, I get to play my my regular attacks, but overpowered. Well, what is he gonna do? He's like, no. Okay, never mind. Good thing she can just shoot back. I didn't even get to see him do his ultimate. You couldn't have done it without me. He really just said that. Oh, he wasn't even far. Yeah, me too. Yep, we're from the Astral Express. Oh, did Madame Herta send you to help? Uh, it's just a coincidence. We came to deliver the rare relic Herta trusted us to find. And we didn't expect to arrive during an invasion. Why is the Antimatter Legion targeting you guys? It seems they just ignored the surface of the planet and came straight to the space station. I have no idea. The Legion came at a very suspicious time, almost right after the security system suddenly failed. Wait, you're the head of the security? Lady... Lead researcher Asta immediately began to organize the evacuation. I was supposed to cover everyone as they evacuated, but... You can come, you can come and help us. To end up failing in this test. And fight the invasion Don't or whatever. Don't be too hard on yourself. Your leg and dominant hand were injured. It was a wise decision to hide here and avoid a head-on encounter with the Legion. Yeah, most of the staff have been evacuated safely. So right now our highest priority is to return to the Master Control Zone and plan a counter-attack. So... Do you know how to show... Do you know how to <laughs> get the elevator? I couldn't start it. Wait, what? After the evacuation... Wait, wait. The elevator's <laughs> shut down to keep the oh, never mind. The Master Control Zone. Like, did she only say it was broken because she didn't want to use it? Since Lady Asta sent you to look for me, I assume she must have given you the encryption key for accessing the elevator system? Oh, right. She did give oh, me my God. card. Mm. March. But where did I oh, you forgot it. You... Somewhere. We 
should get going. We can use that console over there to unlock the elevator. Let's go. Hold on. I only activated the elevator on the highest floor. We'll have to go there to use it. Oh. Okay. Sorry. The space station was entrusted to Lady Asta by Madam Herda. I must do this for the safety of the master control zone and the staff there. So I'll have to trouble you to take a bit of a detour. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Let's go to the highest floor. Huh? You're not coming with us? My leg is injured. I'd only slow you down. I'll stay here and shut down the elevator. What? I don't want him to die. You won't slow us down. And you should be able to shut down the elevators from the master control zone. Right? Agreed. She and I made it here safely, and now we've also got Don hung. We're more than enough to protect you. Let us worry about the antimatter legion. You just follow us and keep yourself alive. Aren't you a nice kid? Thank you. Oh wait, do I really have to do things? I mean, I, I mean, it does. I would. It doesn't really matter, but like. I think that was more of a joke. Yes. Whatever that means. Can I do that for myself too? Everybody, I want everybody to get it. So we're all, we're all on the same page. And not overpowering each other. I'm guessing you don't level up from... I'm fighting. I level myself up. March 7th and get the next one. If I find anything to level her up. Got him with the weakness. Oh, they're both, they're both the, the guys or whatever. I want to see what he can do. Revealed in an instant. This that was really cool. And he got both of them. I think I didn't we didn't even have to do anything. Me and March 7th. What? She didn't even do anything. That's a guy. What is, what is his weakness? I don't know. <laughs> I think that I think that was his weakness. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Well, let's get rid of that guy. Let's make it quick. Ow. Yeah, I know your guys' weakness. That's not good. Clemency? Never heard of it. The time now. Oh, he doesn't revealed in an instant. Oh, he's only a single target guy. Well he can he can kill that guy. Is but a vision. I got him. Take this. Oh, he's almost dead. Oh, never mind. Never mind, he's dead. Reach the end of the story in your own way. What? My character's weird. Let me steal from the ship. Let me get some more health. Oh, I have like little restore stuff. I think that's for like long term or whatever. The repulsion bridge has been shut down. Yeah, let's turn it on. Yes. Just the enemy, more or less. Like he's like staring right at us. 
<laughs> I got him. Never mind. <laughs> oh, he's... Oh, fuck that guy. I'm using my ability. And I got log on for me for no reason. I'm gonna take out two of your guys. They didn't even get a chance. All they did was lock on to me. And they died. I got more protein or ice. I gotta get them gains. Light cones? No. Light cones are garden of recollection technology. They allow you to carry memories around. Very potent enhancement items. I heard the corporation paid a lot for the usage rights. But I have no idea how Herta managed to get hold of one. They have to pay for usage rights. That's all I can say. Take them. They're very useful. Oh. Okay. I don't know, we're just taking shit from Erta light cones provide stats stat boost to characters offset special abilities if the wearer's weak wearer's path matches that of the light cone collapsing sky so it's a memory that gives me oh it's good for me <laughs> It's a destruction one. That's a treasure. More like something that somebody else owned and I just found it laying around and it could be useful to me yes or a treasure is that all? Aww, is that it? that's a big chest over there that wasn't too many i like to go over there uh, you've grown, right? oh did not see that guy coming i think that was the point actually Activates two times speed to experience. Okay. Oh, his weakness bar doesn't go down fast. This is, this is, he's a boss battle guy. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's make it quick. See. Use real time combat view. Uh. Oh, okay. You know, I don't. I mean, it's, pretty, it's, it's a bit interesting, but. That he resisted it. Yeah, the, the, every time you hit me, she's gonna shoot at you because it's her ability. I'm assuming that's why she does it. He's gonna keep hitting this guy because he's a uh, he's weak to him. That is a lot. That did a lot. Oh, that's gonna get all of them. All their weaknesses. I told you I could fight. She didn't really do a lot. I 
it's only just this guy. Oh, she, did she just take away, or or did that guy just take away all of my shield? I don't think so. I, can't I just like give my entire team like defense using March 7th and then she attacks every time? Every time, every time anybody gets attacked, there, there, there might be something that doesn't allow me to do that. Okay, he is, he is doing too much. Like, stop using more actions. Just, just die already. You already lost. You're, you, the guys next to you already died. There you go. He's dead. Or almost dead. Hey, sore losers! You can't just gang up on us. How's oh, a drone? That that's saving us. Who is she? I don't know. I, they, they didn't. They didn't tell me who she is yet. I know that's not her time. Her to somebody else. March, Dun Hong, you've been through a lot. Oh, you, Himeko, what took you so long? Oh, Himeko. The last wave of antimatter legion came at us like a swarm of locusts. <laughs> have you ever tried shooting locusts with a bow? I wouldn't have made a difference. My orbital cannon can deal with a whole bunch of enemies at once, but I couldn't just blow up the space station with it. Herda would not like that. <sighs> Are you all right, Arlan? Asta's been worried about you. I'm fine. A quick patching up will do. Thanks for asking. I'll report the situation to lead researcher Asta immediately. Bye. Bye. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Himiko, navigator of the Astral Express. In other words, she's in charge of where the Express goes. March hasn't she, been she drives the Express. Along the way, has she? she didn't know how to use an elevator. Carefully about how you want to reply to that. <laughs> well, that's the joy of youth. We should take every step forward full of energy. She's a discerning one, isn't she, Don Hung? I have the right to remain silent. <laughs> Look at you all. You've already gotten me. Have friends. Come on. Asta's been worried about all of you. All of us? Oh, he is temporarily in my team. Is that like a what is that? It's a saw? Okay, how the how the hell does that fit in there? <laughs> or is it? Oh, it's like a it's it's like the Swiss Army blade or like knife, and it has a bunch of gadgets. I don't want to die. I can I can listen in. Is there anything I can get here? Former security staff? Emily, calm down and think about what she would do in such a disaster. Ten cups of coffee, a pill, or maybe hide in a room full of... There, there has to be something important here. She has dialogue. Okay, I, I I guess I can't help her. Bernard. 
No, I don't. I don't really care about what what some people have to say. Like that wasn't that important. Do I do I have to find your sister or something? Just taking all their their hard drives or something. I'm gathering information. Because Arlen. Welcome to I did not mean to do that. I was I was like I was trying to get the uh the text to go faster. <laughs> I thought I was I was stuck there and then I couldn't move, but it, it wasn't that. <laughs> I did not meet the hit Arlen. I, I actually want to play Arlen. He's a pretty cool character, which I don't I don't think you can. Space plant. Is it called a Herda Space Station? Because she owns it or something? She named it after herself. Okay. We let, let me go talk to Asta. Projectile radar tracking normal. <laughs> Telemetry signal frequency unusually high. Maintain at normal levels. Our measurements predict that the Legion is about to unleash over 10 waves of continuous attack. Everyone, brace yourselves. Asta, we're back. Oh, I'm glad you're all back safe. Arlen just told me about the situation at the storage zone and about his injury. In, in times of disaster, I realized more... She was going to say thank you all for your help. ...researchers are its most valuable <coughs> assets. Alas, we were ill-prepared for such emergencies. We should have built up our security and combat departments. But on the other hand, the entire crew of the Astral Express seems to be. Excited. Yeah, I'm, I'm part of the, the the crew now. What is the current situation on the space station? The situation is under control for now. The damage to our security system was minor. The intruder only managed to alter a small amount of data, so it was easy to fix. The real problem lies with the researchers. They trust Madame Herta wholeheartedly and never thought that the space station would be breached by the Legion. Hmm. A broken spirit is far worse than a broken body. Let's go speak with the researchers. Right now, the space station can't afford any more unexpected turns, especially from within. Have you tried contacting Herta? I sent multiple letters, all met with silence. You know her, Himiko. The space station is but a mere warehouse for followers and rare items. She doesn't really care about it. I knew it. No matter. I'll also send a letter to Herda and tell her that we've brought the rare item she seeks. At least that might get her attention. Oh, that would be of great help. obtain characters and light cones okay i'm gonna be warping whatever whatever that means i mean like, warps warp what i really gotta use my warp on this one why can i choose a different one i better get a good character if i'm gonna warp He's a bunny guy. It's purple. That means it's 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 good. It's something good. Oh, I got Asta. That's okay. That's a bit convenient. Or like, you know, like she's like right in front of me, and I just got her. What is this? It looks interesting. Oh, it's it's a light core. Like, who is that? I don't know who that is. This is another light core. I, I like to collect characters, not light cores. 
She looked pretty interesting. That's a really cool uniform. But you also get this guy right here too, so not not just her. <laughs> And get Robin and Hope has a Numbi in any of these characters. Okay. Well, I got Asta. I'll leave okay. the assurance of the researchers in your hands. Okay. Like, can I switch you out? Any other questions? Shall keep Himiko because she uh, she is a trial character. Only I caught the antimatter legion sooner. Oh, I'm fine. This pain is nothing really. I'm used to it. In fact, I should be proud of it. Okay, I thought he was talking, but he's not. <clears throat> but uh, don't tell lead researcher. Asked Wait, what did he say? <laughs> Okay. There were a few researchers who didn't make it. The rest are fine, mostly minor injuries. But I'm worried about their mental states. Most of them came to the space station because they admired Madame Curtin. But now they can't reach her or even their own families. I just hope they can all survive this crisis. My first impression was that she was the daughter of a rich family, owners of a big company. She was kind to me, though. But when she went to the space station, I followed her. I don't know much about science, but I'm glad to be able to protect people and pursue their research. Okay. I hope all this chaos will end soon. Yeah, oh, are we, like, planning a counterattack? Whoa. Those light cores? I can equip those on the people. You want a light cone? Which one's good for her? This is a. Uh... Uh, you can have this one. <laughs> Let's see which one can you have? I'm pretty sure they uh, like they give me the ones that are for my characters. Wait, uh, does everybody get Asta? Hold on, like, <laughs> am I not special and I actually got somebody different or whatever? Hold on, I need to look this up. Okay, everybody gets Asta. I'm not special. I thought I thought I got Asta. I was like, well, I got Asta, but no, you, everybody gets Asta. Hold on, I need to charge my phone. Okay, well, I guess I guess I just have Asta then. <laughs> it's like everybody else. The head of ecology. Oh, sorry, sorry, I got the wrong person. Yeah, let me Thanks, help. Kid. We're doing some pre-checks for the satellite remote sensing. I'll hold down the button to monitor the signal, and you push the control stick according to my instructions. Okay. First, let's talk about the controls. Up is the spectrometer, down is the filter, left is the reference level, and right is the attenuator. That's that's too many instructions. Our have three steps. Turning on the spectrometer, then the attenuator, and finally outputting the signal to the filter. It's quite a bit to remember. You got everything? Yeah, can you read that again? It again? The controls are up for the spectrometer, up. down for the filter, left <laughs> for the reference level, and right for the attenuator. So up, up, ex the fuck? Okay, up is spectro, down is filter, left is reference, right is attenuator spectro filter reference attenuator spectro filter the pre-checks have three steps are you ready wait 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 <laughs> wait 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 what, what did she say what did she say she said um you checks are turning on this okay so it's i'm not gonna look at this line right here because i know that's the answer so it's up i think right never mind i i'm gonna look at it 
It's up? No, no, it was right. Okay, up right. I'll putting the signal to the filter. Down. Up right down. Wonderful, thank you. <laughs> that was very helpful of you, kid. Alfred was the researcher in charge of this. He was in the storage zone earlier. He didn't make it back. Abraham was close to him. Uh, I don't know how to tell him about it. The top priority is to preserve the space station and concentrate on the work at hand. Okay, well, I helped her. I'm gonna go talk to... I think, I think it's the person that was missing their sister. I talked to her already, but I think I gotta talk to her again and then find their sister or something. Never mind. I need to oh, wait, it's Abraham. I need to run from this forsaken. No, it's impossible. I can run from yesterday. I can run from today, but tomorrow will always be one step ahead of me. Look! The obstacle detection terminal has recorded 142,856 attacks. The next count will be 142,857. I know in my heart that when I see that um, what? beautiful cyclic number, it will mean the poetic end of what? the life cycle. Everyone keeps saying that. Things will get better. Things won't always be this bad. Negative, positive, a negative of a negative is a positive. And life inevitably comes to an end the day. How insightful. Yes, of course. The closer you approach death, the more you appreciate life. I will pull myself together. Hold on. Thank you. That was kind of you. I need to check something on Discord. I'm gonna say good morning because I, I accidentally went to sleep today on Discord. <laughs> like, when I, before, before I started the stream, I was actually asleep. And I, I accidentally fell asleep. I didn't mean to. What? Who do I get? She gave she gave me something. Oh, I got a special pass. Who even is she? Hold on. I don't know who she is. I have to I have to play the game before I can do that one. Trial. Oh. My god, it's Herta. It's Herta. I like I like Herta. Or I don't know anything about Herta, but her design is pretty cool, so I like Herta. <laughs> I helped some people. Two people. Oh. Take the express and leave. I'll stay. But let's go. I I wasn't processing what was happening. I was. Communications. So you're thinking of going back? Well, let me remind you. That's the Doomsday Beast. The Legion's planet destroyed. Oh, no. I think we can kill him. The space station is Herta's creation. As long as the Lord Ravager doesn't intervene, there should be no problems. <laughs> but we can't just run away like this, right? <sighs> the Doomsday Beast can rip off the defense shield like tearing paper. And Herta's not here. The station's defenses are too weak to stand against the antimatter legion. Either way, the legion has the blessing of the Eon Nanook. They came prepared, and everyone here is not. Can we just get the gun that rates the creatures and then, I don't know, maybe rate? Actually, it's only at 100. It might just say 100 and then 
it, it's a, probably way higher than that. What? She's that important? She's the one who can help us turn the tides. What? I just I just got here. Hmm. As you say so. All right. What should we do next? This is the supply zone where the maintenance crew works. There's a path here that leads to the railway platform. Let's head over there and meet up with Welt. Welt? Like world in German? Mr. Yang? Mr. Yang's here too? Didn't he stay on the express? The Astral Express tracks our coordinates in real time. And with such a huge change in the space station's movements, there's no way Mr. Yang wouldn't have noticed. Mm hmm. I can almost guarantee that your Mr. Yang is already on his way. Right now, we might be able to handle things if it's just the Doomsday Beast, but if the Destruction's Emanator were to appear. Yeah, who who is that guy? Let's hurry up and get out of here. I'll okay, you. yeah, I think that's a better idea. Ooh, level four, level four. <laughs> oh, I just had the oh, it was allergies. I have, I have allergies. It is spring and there's pollen everywhere. Oh, I didn't know this guy was here. Clemency never heard of. Oh, they locked onto him. Was she can follow up with attacks. So I should hit people with a really good attack then. Hit all three of these guys. When the charge reaches three points, Himiko will automatically launch a follow up. Okay, that means I have to. Oh, never mind. I have something for you. She has a Swiss Army knife. You're pretty cool attack. Oh, they both died. Okay, I don't think I need to activate my ultimate. He's gonna die. More protein rice. I got some space plants. Can we take some space plants home? Like it is Herta's plants, they must be really good or something, I don't know. Oh wait, how do these plants even live? Uh, the exit's over there. How do we get to it? We walk. You may have me locked in, but I have a bat. And they are getting destroyed. Hold on, did you lock onto somebody? Did they lock? I don't think they did. I, they did not lock onto anybody. This is our chance. Hold on. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. I can keep playing the game. The game's pretty fun. I don't know why I stopped playing it. Uh, 
like her outfit. Like, look at this outfit. Oh, wait, it's it's way different on on the other side. But like, look at this jacket. It, it looks very stiff for some reason. Oh, she's reading. Uh -huh. What book is she reading? It's it's in their language. I don't know. Like she's wearing a dress and she has a jacket. It's a really cool design. That's a weird bridge design. Oh. Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Actually, no. Just a regular attack. I don't think I need to go attack. overboard. I told you I could fight. <laughs> you won't get away. Let's make it quick. Take this. I got all of them before they can even make a move. Space anchor. I'm assuming they're. Whoa, whoa. I'll explain you may encounter powerful enemies if I defeat them to get bountiful rewards. Okay. Let me get on my phone right in front of him. <laughs> like, <laughs> there's gotta be... Something I could do to make myself a bit high level. To, uh... Maybe even, like, surpass him. <laughs> like, he's level 11, I think I'm, like, level 4. A survey. Oh. No, 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 I don't want to do a survey. Like, I don't want to do it on stream. Oh, I already... View registration and social media rewards. I did that? <laughs> okay, I'll take all of it. I get Serval. He's a pretty cool character. Oh, and I get... I don't know, I don't know what he is. He looks like a penguin. I don't... Or not, not a penguin, a bunny. A bunny guy. It's a little bunny guy. Oh, I do have stuff to level myself up. Wait, who needed to level up? No, I can level up Asta. She, what, what is she? A Rudition? Rudition. Erudition. Erudition. You can level up. Because I just got her. And she's probably going to be my next character. Unless it's going to be Asta. I don't know. They're both. Wait. Okay. Never mind. I don't know what I was talking about. Just forget what I said. She. What, what is. I don't know what that means. What is. Oh, lightning. Okay, that's. That's something. I level myself up. Level six. I'll do that for these peoples too. Yo, know, hopefully when I don't know she's a wait, no, I never customized the trial character or like Himiko. So I I'm assuming this assuming you can't take this off, because if you could that means I get a free light cone. I can change my supporting character. There you go. My companions, they're the same. You know, only the both same. Oh, wait, can I change my profile picture? I'll keep it that one. Okay, I don't care about the profile stuff. We need a strategy. 
I have the strategy. I hit him and then he gets weakened and Move carefully. Okay, these guys look these guys are scary. Perhaps you still don't understand. Wait, it's just She just glassed them. She's like the Covenant from Halo. Yeah. I'm destroying them. All your friends are dead. Oh, and she just went. He just went straight for March 7th, and she is almost like. Almost. Or not almost it, but she took a lot of damage. The truth of life and death revealed in an invisible is but a vision. There you go. Oh. I told you I could fight. Well, she the the guy doesn't have oh no oh, I don't want to do any of that the guy doesn't have um. Doesn't have a lock on because he's stunned. <laughs> oh, he healed? I think? I think that was a healing thing. Okay. You have the worst luck running into me. With yeah, she might die. She might die. She might die. Combat is a series of precise machinations. Found one, come on. Yeah, she March seventh is gonna die. Oh, never mind. Well, actually, no, no, no she will die. He, he's supposed to be hard. It's okay. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. And I'm no exception. She literally did that in the space station. She's already dead, okay? Calm down. Well, I don't I don't know if she's dead, but she's she's a hologram. You won't get away. This is our chance. Better up. Time for a detailed overhaul. One at a time. Oh wait. Okay, apparently she's not dead. Okay, she could defense to herself. I think that's what saved her. Step aside. I have no Let's make it quick. Rules are made to be broken. Come on, let me get them. Okay. Give me what's in that chest. Would it be something good? The void? Okay. <laughs> so they, they put the whole void into a chest. I think it's like a memory of the void. There we go. Everybody, everybody is back. Back to full health.
What was that guy doing? You won't get away. Oh, I already. Okay. I already weakened them. Oh. Shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I have defense. It's not gonna work. I have something for you. Oh, she can't blast. You won't get away. Can I got all of them? <laughs> She's pretty good. Like that ability is pretty good. Because if I weaken people, then she just comes in and fucks them up, and then I win. What's that guy doing? Hello. Perhaps you still don't understand. You know, you know the concealed its desire to control the heavens. And I know like she is a pretty good character. I, I don't know. I know there's like a meta in the game, but I don't really care about it. And I, I like to play the characters. Well, like in a lot of games that I play, I like to play the characters that I like. So if there's a character with really good design, I like to play with them. Or as them. Let's make it quick. And I think uh Oh no, she's she's a pretty good character, like uh for design. But or she's also pretty good, like in, in my opinion I think she's good. So I don't know. I don't know if there's any I don't know if there's more better characters, but I, li I like I like her and her design. And she got the fucking defense. She's gonna come in if I get uh oh. This is our chance. Rules are made to be broken. Yeah, she's gonna come in now. Combat is a series of precise machinations. And he died. Protein rice. And every time I see protein rice, I'm gonna say it because it's pretty funny. <laughs> Just getting protein rice. Oh, max technique points. And yeah, we made it. It was an ambush? Why? What, what is that? A dragon? Oh. Let's kill him. Wait, is that like a window or? Okay, that was not a window. I thought it was a window, but oh, you know, I think that's like the, it's like a window, but like for, like, getting out or in, I think. It was like a loading bay or something. Also, I don't know if we can beat him. He's already doing a lot. Move carefully. Oh, I have to beat his beat up beat up his hands. She she's she's getting ready. She's getting ready to do something. Let's make it quick. Uh, 
Uh, what did that do? And then she's gonna come in. She's gonna come in. Okay, there you go. It was like a combo. Okay, he's doing a lot of damage. I'm only beating up his hands, so I don't know how how good this is gonna be. Okay, it's broken. Let's go. Take this. Right hand broke. I don't know if the single attack is uh, better, but I don't know. I'm gonna find out. The truth of life and death. Oh, thanks for the follow. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna try. <laughs> okay. Okay. Beat the score, or whatever. Hopefully, I don't have to like fight them fully and these are the only things I have to take out his engine is broken oh never mind. wait okay I do have to fight him fully that is a lot of damage let's make it quick Wait, he completely regenerated. Okay. I don't know if we can last that long. Especially with this attack. This might be like the death blow right here. It wasn't the death blow. It was something. I don't know what that was. Clemency? Never heard of it. She's getting ready. Himiko is getting ready. Somebody's gonna die. I think Dun Hung is gonna die if he punches him. Yep. Okay, that's bad. bunch of combos on him. Let's see what how how he likes that one. I don't know, he might win. Oh she's gonna do it again. Okay, I think I think getting rid of the hands, unless unless this engine can do some attacks, I think doing the uh, right there, hitting the hands first is good. Never mind, never mind, never. Mind. <laughs> we are dead. I don't know. I think I think only March Seven is gonna survive this one. Never mind. This is better than uh, not doing anything. Okay, all he can do is charge up, so I have to like get him before he can uh, do that. Let's go. This is how I'm gonna get him. You won't get away. Okay. 
I think this is the last time I have to do this. Nope, I got him. And the audio cut out. Oh, I, I specifically gave you a shield for this. She she could have survived. What happened? Who is that? That means I didn't die. I just blew up the space station. No, never mind. Oh, that was my moment. Why did he do that? Mr. Yang, is she? You're okay now. Let's talk somewhere else. Oh god, it's the train. It's Sunkai Star Rail. Yeah. Is, is this... this... Oh, I have a voice. Hi. This is not the train. I thought we got onto the train. That you've made it through in one piece. You can rest easy now that the threat from the Legion has been Did we, like, take out their big bad guy? Well, this invasion seems to be nothing more than a random provocation. As soon as the Doomsday Beast fell... The Legion retreated. I guess I'll leave you to rest up a bit for the time being. By the way, um, what's your beacon address? That way, if anything happens, I can contact you. Is my phone number? Go see Himiko when you have the time. She said she had something to discuss with you. What kind of message? He, he's already texting me? Okay, never mind. Like, hi, uh, go do what I told you to do. Idolins. Idolins? I don't know how you pronounce that. Enhance my ability. As elusive as it may appear. Yeah, my character is scary. She is scary. Maybe it's because I don't know how it compares to, like, the other main character, like the male one, but they're scary. I still have her. I still have Himiko. A lot of that's dogs and cats, no normal, and then cats ragdoll breed. Where are the dogs? Where the dogs at? I want to know where the dogs are. Can I get a? Am I gonna get a really big reward for protecting the the ship? You're awake. I had Marge and Dan Hung stay by the express to keep an eye on things. It's almost time. She should be arriving any moment now. I've only been gone what a few months. And Wait, she's a. Is already in this state. She's a doll? Welcome back, Herda. She's like a toy. This is the true master of the space station. She has a little the like ball things. Herda. At least give me a proper introduction. <coughs> Genius Society number 83. Of all my outstanding achievements, that's what you want to mention? Space station Herda. Oh, I was like, is that really her? Is she really a doll? She's not. She just looks like a doll, or this puppet thing looks like a doll. So, this little twerp has the Skeleron now? 
Huh. So, truly amazing. I built a whole space station just to contain this unactivated Stellaron and keep the blue from disaster. Yet someone was able to achieve that with this little twerp's body? How did they do it? Moreover, oh, no. Stellaron is still very stable in her body. <laughs> You're right. This little one's body truly is strange. Yeah, this uh I I, I am your Stellaron. I I am I, I am what came out of that Stellar or I am the Stellaron. <laughs> Oh yeah, wasn't that? That would make sense. Oh. You have like a oh, limited amount of memories life. before you start just... That's why you're not allowed to uh, live forever, because you'll forget. Like you you have like missing... Like when, once you fill up all your memories... <laughs> we're, like, we're like computers, except... To make space for memory, it just takes out whatever the fuck it wants. <laughs> And then you forget stuff. That's different. We have business with each other. Um, what was your name again? I think that's how it works. I don't, I don't like quote me on that one. Uh, uh, forget it. But let's focus on the one who can store a Stellaron in their body. Can I bring her in for some research? That's not up to me to decide. You can ask. Yeah, that's not yourself. ethical. If you don't ask me. Yeah, well, how much are you gonna give me? Oh, uh. so I like it. All right, give the poor child a break, Herda. I'm very interested now. So there's almost nothing I won't accommodate. A Stellaron in your body? How interesting is that? Be grateful that I'm offering to help you out. This is a service even the IPC can't buy. Who who are those people? You understand now? Herda wants you to stay in her space station. And can I work for Herta? Herta? Well, I'm going to have to modify your wording here. This little twerp can only stay temporarily until the research is done. Or maybe I'll lose interest halfway through and they can just beat it. And after that? <laughs> Not my problem. <sighs> you also have another option. The Astral Express. If you want, you can leave with us. The Express has its fair share of experiences with Stellarons. The thing you're worried about and the answers we're looking for are one and the same. Besides, we can come back any time to let her to conduct her research. She's absolutely fascinated now. Hmm. Well, works for me. Keeps this subject fresh, too. And that what? way, I won't need to keep worrying about this little twerp all the time. Get on the express or stay behind. Yes, give it some good thought. Just remember to come back often. Make an appointment in advance with Asta or Arlen so I can make time to study you. There's no need to rush into this, Herda. Asta's in the master control zone. Let's let her have a talk with Asta first and decide for herself. I'll be waiting for you on the platform. It's no hurry if you still have things to do or someone to see. Come find me when you've made your decision. Okay. Oh, I, I have her phone number now. I uh, violate H. Herta. I need you for something good. Come quickly. Go <laughs> to my office quickly. I'm waiting. Okay. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I have to add a new character because Himiko left. I can have Asta. Do I have to go talk to Asta if I have Asta on my team? I don't know who I want to put on. I mean, I like Asta's Asta's design. Uh, well, I'll, I'll, I'll say that for a lot of characters, they all have really good designs. But I'll add her because. I don't know. Let me go talk. Oh, I have to go there. 
I thought I was gonna go talk to Asta, not not go to her office. What's next on the agenda? Can we talk? Oh, I don't want to. I, I don't care. Okay, I I guess I'll go there. But I heard Taz's office. This is your office? Hey, there you are. Who's waiting for you? I've been busy. What you're seeing is one of my remote control puppets. They're all over the station. I just connect to one wherever I am needed. Enough chit chat. I am working on a big project with a few colleagues. If we succeed, it will answer the ultimate question that's been puzzling us for thousands of amber eras. The truth about eons. Eons. Think about it. What mystery? You know, I just got here. You don't have. To, I don't. I don't. I don't want to. I don't, don't want to think about very advanced to obtain power beyond our things. Imagination. They are mysterious, powerful, silent, and terrifying. It's hard to explain all the mysteries surrounding them. Why are these like? Why? Why are they like in all caps? You didn't really like. How were they created? Why were they created? What were they? Okay, that's enough questions. Forty-two. Well, indeed, it's got nothing to do with you, but we need you. Give me some time. I'll make this worthwhile for you too. The four geniuses of the society wrote a program together. You see the big machine in the office? That machine contains a universe. Just like the universe we live in, but it's more streamlined and customized. I call it the metaverse. Oh no. <laughs> uh... Oh really? That's what my partner said as well. Fine. I am a team player. Then let's call it the simulated universe. Now go and experience it for yourself. I will guide you in the simulated universe to make sure nothing happens to you. I'll even give you a substantial reward. <laughs> Today is the yesterday's tomorrow. This is the beta. Yes, just stand there and the computer will read your brain waves. Then automatically generate a this sounds like like some conspiracy theory stuff, even though, or like the brainwave stuff, not the simulated universe. This is like a video game, like I'm playing a video game within a video game. The alpha test server. Move around, we we'll need to play with the key really and find some monster to fight. Let's see which simulating on we'll notice you first. Okay, look at those two kids so you don't have to fight alone. Uh act auto battle. I don't I don't wanna do auto battle. I like fighting. I could fight. Let's go. It would make sense that she would call them kids because she's like old. He's old. What is this? Uh, the copper ore, countless copper ore, amber, and opal falling from the sky. I don't know what this is. <laughs> There's a huge roar around them. This is a warning for you. Then they disappear before your eyes. And that's Herta. 
uh, calculations are correct. Uh, has really uh, like no uh, uh, gig suddenly sounded. She let out an ambiguous giggle. Uh, they, a uh, uh, what? Uh, what was that? He saw simulating on uh, carefully cultivated by Ron May. Okay, I don't know what 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 is she talking about? Try to get something out of the Eon. Okay, what do you want to know? I'll cover you for this test. Uh, see, I use my clearance and enhance your blessing. They can go have some fun. Don't ask why. Just think me. Go pick one. Okay. See a shield. When a character inflicts weakness, break it on the target. The character gains a shield. Upon entering a battle, all characters gain a shield. I had to pick one. I'll pick this one because it looks better than the other two. Alright, is this part is this part of the main story? Do I really have to do this? My turn. Give herself a shield. She has she she can die very easily. He made a really big mistake hitting March because she has a shield on and now she has another one Oh, everybody has a shield because that's uh, that's what I have never heard of it battle over uh i guess much pick the blessing that turns shield into damage and hurry onward that turns shield into damage i think she wants me to use this one I, I, I don't know i don't know how i knew that i just i just guessed it's like simulated fighting it's too late to repent rules are made to be broken I'm gonna speed up the process now. You're gonna fight three times in a row. It's, it's not how some of the universe should operate, but I'm running out of patience. Be sure to collect reservation, reservation blessings. Okay, see if we can get to whether to, to find out more or whatever. Yeah, what does this have to do with me? Like, she made it sound like I had like a lot to do with it when I didn't. interest in stoking conflict I'll try hard sometimes check out this you just say you gotta try hard sometimes <laughs> doesn't matter the truth of life and death revealed in an instant this search is but a vision <laughs> Defense, defense, defense. We all have defense. Let me give herself defense. She's gonna need it. That's why. Uh, that, that's why. They always attack her. I, I did, did they just not like her? Clemency? Never heard of it. These guys aren't weak to any of these attacks. Try that again. 
No, she got him. He got him. Okay, I should have looked at weakness first. I only attacked him because he had a lot of health. You can't run. Let's make it quick. Battle over. Come on. What do you mean, come on? I was just I was just having fun fighting. Oh yeah, this was for every battle. Okay. Defeat the boss. Okay, I'll defeat the boss. Move carefully. Rules are made to be broken. Hit this guy. He's, he's like the big, the main boss. The truth of life and death revealed in an Just in case he charges up, I'm gonna hit him with this. Because he's gonna charge up, and then I could uh, get him, get him without uh. Oh, never mind. I just broke him right now. That's probably really bad, because if he does charge up, that means he's gonna... He's actually gonna hit it. That might break my shield. They're doing a lot to uh, kill themselves, because March... Oh, never mind, she didn't do it that time. Oh, he's charging. Maybe I can freeze him before he does it. But I don't know if it works. I don't know if she can freeze him while he's charging up. Never mind. She did. <clears throat> She's gonna need it. Let's make it quick. And she blocked it, or she tanked it. That isn't gonna do anything. She tanked it, but she's a bit disoriented. Okay, she's back. Never mind. And then I'm just gonna. I think she has the infinite shield now, or like enough shield to where any attack won't really do anything. Okay, he's dead. Revealed in She's really, she's really trying. She's really trying. Oh! Okay. Yo, I have no idea what any of this means. This is like all the blue. 
play all day came or something. I don't know. This really kicked me out of the metaverse, out of her role playing game. Wait, I'm really gonna do another one? Oh, but we will! After all, you're gonna be spending more time on this project. In a nutshell, this is a long scheduled version update with longer game. <laughs> She's making a game. Better rewards and a more bizarre difficulty curve. So get ready and prepare to get back into the simulated universe. I'll help you out some more. She's just making me like, oh, I got hurt. Huh? It's like she's making me just play games the entire time. Wait, did I get hurt or did I get a puppet hurt? Huh? I think I got a puppet. Hey, can I get out of here? She's making me play. She's making me play role play games, role playing games. Where to now? Teleporting function. Use the navigate quickly, move between different locations, supply zone. Okay. Do I, do I really have, okay. Carlin, got your number without asking, are you still at the space station? Station is launching a program called Project Revival. If you have time, I'd like to ask, ask for your help. Oh, my, my phone credits for this month are running out. This is the last message. Why don't they give him free phone credits? Doesn't he? He works at a like, space station. He works at space station place. He should get free credits. He is a security guy. Oh, this is the Torio. Look at my phone. I get these these crystals. I don't know what they do. Characters I have Herta. I don't have the 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 Herta. I just have puppet. Herta. She can have the void. Oh no, she can't. Or she can, but it's not good. Find someone to talk to and tell Himiko your decision. I don't know, what is that supposed to mean? Like... So find someone to talk to and tell him, okay? Hey, I heard the news! You're coming with us on the express, right? You wanna come along? Do I even need to say it? I think we're becoming fast friends. Isn't that enough? But you look like you've got something on your mind. Come on, out with it! Yeah, I have to choose. Okay, do I, do I really make a decision or like I'm predestined because I'm pretty sure you're supposed to go with them. 
Yeah. Yeah. She's just gonna be like, "Are you sure?" Have you thought things through? Yes. Never mind. Wait. So, I'll just I'll just join. You, you can't just not join. I can either join or I can go back and do play play test Herta's play test Herta's um game. This is loud. I can't hear anything. This is loud. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, what? What? What does he want? Okay. Okay, it wasn't that long. I thought it was gonna you be longer. What? Yes, Pom Pom's talking to you. It's kind of rude. Himiko told Pom Pom about your situation. Now listen up. Pom Pom will only say this once. Pom Pom's sure there have been lots of people telling you how special you are lately. But this is the Astral Express. And everyone on here has their secrets. Since you chose to board, you can abide by the rules. You're not the only special one here. I didn't best remember that. I'm do I act special? Just I, I don't I don't really do anything trouble. that actually no, I have a fucking I have something in my chest. Never mind. Complete operation briefing according to instructions to obtain rewards. Sure. Strategic training. In strategic training, we can learn combat related knowledge and receive corresponding rewards. Okay, I guess I have to do it. I'm gonna check something on my phone. Oh, where are we? Where the hell are we? Are we, are we in the, a city? Are they, are they teaching me stuff I already know? Hold on. I'm trying to do something on my phone. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I don't want to. I don't want to. Okay. Go points. I know this. Can never only receive skill damage. Use skills to defeat enemies. Okay. Who's that? Who's the third person? Why did you make me do it if it's not gonna <laughs> it's not gonna do anything? <laughs> but he can he doesn't have to do s skill stuff Like who's this third character? Oh, there's more people Let's go The truth of life and death revealed in an instant this search is but a vision Oh, that didn't do a lot. I thought that was gonna work Wait, shouldn't she be doing all the work? Cause she can hit more than. Never heard of it. She can hit more than two characters or one character. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, it doesn't. It doesn't do a lot. I want to see her ultimate. I don't even know who she is. We do it again. They really made me do training. Let's 
looks like, what, what is she doing there? She's just sitting there. Okay. This train car is huge. Like, I'll be a little bit more narrow. Or, hi, pom pom. You are not doing anything. How can I help? Just a photograph. Himiko always likes to bring back weird junk and try to fix it. That also got modified a bit. Don Hong's room? Oh, you mean the archive? Ah, uh, he's just sort of living in there, I guess. I can't be bothered getting him out. Mark Seven's room is right next to the archive. You can visit him on the way. And is her room also meant for something else? In her room? Oh, Pom Pom remembers Himiko saying that you saved her. Mm, very brave. Very foolhardy. But that is what a trailblazer should be like. March 7th's room is in the express sleeper compartment. She's always running around, so she might not be there. Pom Pom still needs to prepare for the express's warp jump. You can look around the place yourself. No matter where you go on what? the train, Pom Pom will always have my eyes on you. Is he the only person that does maintenance on this train? He doesn't have like any workers or like any other Pom Poms. She says it can play melodies from the past. Well, likes collecting these jet black discs. It seems like they could be antiques. He'd be very happy if you could bring a few back. Use the phonograph to change music when on the express by exploring various worlds you can obtain new records unlock new tracks i feel like that one's gonna get me copyrighted I, don't know, I think I like this one, or is or is it this one? I like this one. Mm. You know, I don't think I can get copyrighted. It's only on YouTube, though. So maybe if it Twitch blocks it, then I can post it. I haven't even... learned to sense incoming visitors after people kept barging in so frequently. Okay. Hi. Oh, that's a nice... It's not even his room, but it's the archive room. Oh, he... <laughs> okay. Can I help you? Feel free. looking around. This is open to everyone on the express. Yeah, I can I can see that. While many of the roads that Akivili traveled along no longer exist. I think it's still meaningful to record our adventures as current passengers of the express. I enter the collected data into the archives data bank. I try to catalog the people and places the express encounters and compare and contrast them with the existing records. Do you see the terminal over there? It can be used to view information already stored in the data bank. Do give it a go. You can read stuff on a computer. I already found all of these. Data bank. You can view each story, store each character's story and voice lines. Choice isn't as elusive as it may appear. I'm not done yet. Journeys never end. This is my will. March, lead the counterattack. I believe in you, Dunhung. Let's make this quick. This is our chance. 
Okay. Kind of weird that they have. <laughs> they just have. Do, do you listen to the voices? To what her room's about. The door is unlocked. Should I go in? Just, just a little one peek. Look should be fine, right? Yeah, I don't know. Pom pom. I don't know. Okay, this is an actual room instead of like Don Hung's room. That what is that? A capybara? Some it's a space animal. Pom pom toy. That's what they look like without. Cl oh. Okay. Bunny shaped lounge chair with a teddy bear sitting in it. A fitting metaphor for their conflicted owner. Make a choice I won't regret. Reach the future. Yeah, these these are photos from the game. So much had happened in such a short time. Like that one right there, that's when the attack was happening. It only wants to show March 70. She has like little clothing. Is that for Pom Pom? Okay, I guess I could, uh, I can go. I didn't get to hear what he was gonna say. Uh... I wanted to hear what I was going to say. I guess I'll never hear unless I restart the game. But I'll find out once I go back. So it doesn't really matter. Because I'm pretty sure he was calling everybody. What did you say? <sighs> you took long enough. But at least everyone's here now. He won't be here. So just leave him be. That sounds like... An oh yeah! Something that happens a lot. A tiny bonus from the conductor to the passenger. Think of it as an investment in your future growth. He gave me money. He's, he's giving me a lot. How much money does this guy have? Who, who pays him? Do I pay like a tax to be on the train? Try not to be like March. Always running around the express. It's like a meeting. Pom Pom's going to start the final preparations for the jump. Add friends, receive support, and challenge strong enemy. My friend menu. I have no friends. <laughs> Stellar gate. I don't know what they do, but they look they look fancy. Yeah, I wonder what's the next stop. Like, where are we going? The universe. This is loud. The Astral Express. Eons. <sighs> Did I get dragged into a science fiction movie or something? This Stellaron thing. In my mind. Are you the stars? <laughs> that she really ruined it. Before. But it wasn't stars for me, though. It was lights. She really ruined that I moment. Woke up after being rescued from the ice, I could see clusters of stars in front of me. 
I reached out for them automatically, but they turned out to be the carriage ceiling lights. Oh, she, so I was doing the same thing? The whole crew was watching me. It was pretty embarrassing. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Before all this, I was stuck in a huge block of ice drifting through space. Mimeko and Mr. Yang and... Who was it again? Anyway, they figured out a way to melt the ice and saved me. Yeah, how did... How, what were you doing? Like, what? Who knows? I don't remember anything before oh. that. Who I am? Where I'm from? My name? It's like everything was erased from my mind. March 7th was the day they found me, so it stuck. Ever since then, I've been hanging out on this train and following it to whatever destination it decides to stop at. I'm hoping that one day, I can find my past. Uh, what am I talking about this for? A way to get everyone down, huh? It's fine. I was the one who brought it up. <laughs> Cheer up! It's not every day someone gets to ride on the Astral Express. Ah, here comes the conductor. The Express has reached a safe distance from the space station. We'll be jumping in about 10 minutes. Return to your seats, please. Both of you! Things could get bumpy. What? Uh, thanks, Pom Pom. But did you really have to come and remind me? I'm not a newbie, you know. Well, it wouldn't be necessary, but Miss March 7th likes to challenge herself and falls over every time. That's just called never giving up. <laughs> Conductor, can I get a juice, please? Thank you. Uh, we're jumping in five minutes. You can have something to drink when it's over. Jumps are like this. They may feel novel the first few times. You play chess while we're having a jump. As for the mechanism, well, <laughs> if you're interested, I'll explain it to you in detail when we have more time. For now, just sit and wait. Remember to close your eyes. It helps with the dizziness. Okay. You guys, you guys have your own seats? It's a small planet called Urelo 6. It's been thousands of years since the last time the Express paid a visit. The data bank shows it was a lush and beautiful place. It better stay the same. And after all this time, it's possible that it better not be like a wasteland. <laughs> okay, let me go sit down. Can I, can I just lay on the couch? Oh, let me talk to some other people. Oh, don't worry about me. I just want to see if I can stay on my feet this time. Can I join her? Thanks. I feel like I'm starting to get the hang of it. The key is using your core, waist, and leg muscles. It's not your stance that matters, but your ability to ride the inertia. Well, don't mind me. Find a place to sit down and buckle up. Pump hum got anything to say about this? I'm not gonna go and talk to the actually can I? I wonder. Hmm. Oh, he locked it. Okay, we sit on the couch. Hello? Hello, hello? <clears throat> All passengers, please return to your seats. The train is about to make the jump. Hold on, everyone. I won't fall over. I won't fall over. Five, four, three, two, one. She just cuts to her being on the floor. Yeah, it's a wasteland. Uh huh. So that snowy planet is our oh. destination this time. Yes. Looks like oh, it's snowing. It's not. Won't be easy. It's not like a desert or there's like nothing there. It's not just a bunch of sand. Spatial readout anomaly. Star rail stability is down to twelve percent. Schedule alteration. Seven day stop over time extended indefinitely. 
anomaly. <laughs> yeah, what is that? Hmm. The complex locality of this world has been affected somehow. The star rail has been blocked off by something. Take an ordinary train as an example. It's like the tracks up ahead have suddenly snapped, and the way forward leads straight into a collapsing abyss. The only sensible thing to do would be to break hard, right? If we try to force our way ahead, there could be a hefty price to pay. This again? Don't tell me. It's gotta be. Like, does, does the train go on rail, rails? I, I, I'm assuming it doesn't with a spaceship. Unless it does, I don't know. The results of the preliminary analysis are here. The anomaly stems from a Stellaron, as always. Yes, just like the one that's been placed into your body. Don't worry. It's not the first time our route has been obstructed by a Stellaron. Yeah, I don't even know what they are. Like, they put it in me for some reason. Mystery. Even Herta isn't able to oh. fully understand them. But at least we know how to neutralize their influences. The only thing we can say for sure is that their arrival causes massive changes to civilizations and ecosystems. They also generate distortions in space, such as fragmentums. There must be an inextricable connection between the Stellaron we're dealing with here and Urelo 6 becoming a frozen planet. Our current theory is that Stellarons are seeds of disaster, planted by a certain eon throughout the universe. We can't continue to trailblaze without removing the source of the disaster. That we've got to get busy. Did you did you uh, not fall? I, I don't know if she did. Blazing expedition to March, Dan Hung and you. The objective okay. is clear. Find the Stellaron responsible for the disaster and the spatial distortions and bring it back to the Express. We'll deal with the rest. Awesome! We get to work as a team again! Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't really question if it's I was in this situation. Team back in the space station. My guess is that if you spend even longer together, we'll see something even more impressive. So it's still not our turn. I know you really want to go, but we should give the youngsters a chance to get out there on their own. It'll be a good opportunity for them to bond. March, if you two are ready, why not go and find Dan Hung? He's probably already started collating the ecological data and survey results for your Relo 6. It's always good to know more about the destination before you start a journey. Grand cool adventure. We're going to a winter place. Oh, I found him. He didn't go too far. Are you doing okay after your first jump? Dizziness or retching are normal reactions. You'll feel better once you get used to it. Hmm. So you have high compatibility with the Express. That's good. I went through the Express's database. And it seems the environment on Urelo 6 has undergone drastic changes in the past few centuries. It was not a frozen planet to begin with. He said so? Hmm. Considering the spatial obstacles that the Star Rail has encountered, it's highly possible. I've conducted a preliminary survey and found that there's one area with yeah, relatively uh, normal temperature on the surface of the planet. Only told me you would know that already. By normal, I mean Himiko a temperature told me that, that about allows for human survival. If I had to choose a site for initial investigation on this trailblazing expedition, that would be it. <laughs> As I expected, before you came. Whenever March wanted to go anywhere, Himiko would make Mr. Yang and me go with her. She's like a like a child. And even after you arrived, I didn't suppose I'd be the one to be liberated of that duty. 
I assume the trailblazing objective this time is to find the Stellaron on Uriel 6 and dispel the effect it's exerting on the Star Rail. Right? Yes. I see. You should find March. I'll join you two once I'm ready. I gotta go find her? She was... Um, she's right there. Oh, uh, <laughs> Trying to look cool with his poker face. Don't mind him. Relax. Don Hung and I are experienced trailblazers. We got your back. Well, are you ready? Yeah, let's go. I, there's the nothing else. Well, actually, I want to go see my carriage. I thought a world covered in ice. Could it have something to do with my past? Now I can't stop thinking about it. Still, the ice that trapped me was six base ice, a very rare substance. I don't think you can find it on your average planet. We won't know what, unless we have to look at ourselves. Yeah. To be honest, I think I'd be kind of annoyed if I found out this was my home world. It looks freezing. Pretty girls aren't frost resistant. What? Is there something on my face? Nah, I was just imagining all the fun we're gonna have here. <laughs> mm. I feel sorry for this world. First the Stellaron. Damn. You. Damn. <laughs> Dean. We don't get any like winter clothes. We're just in our same clothing. You reload six. We're here. <sighs> it really is one big snowball. Hey, get your own metaphor. <sighs> Snow as far as the eye can see. Which direction should we take? Based on the coordinates. Target should be up ahead. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go. Me neither. If only we had a snowmobile. We never get to bring anything cool from the express. Do you remember what you did to our last snowmobile? <laughs> anyway, moving on. Yeah, what happened to the last snowmobile? Remember, we should stay vigilant. We know very little about this world. Calm down. Between the three of us, nothing will stand in our way. I mean, come on. You've got a Stellaron in your body. I have my special six phase ice powers. And Don Hung. Uh, he's got that mysterious past thing going for him. So if people start creating trouble for us, they're gonna regret it. ahead of ourselves <laughs> let's go brave thing the unknown that's the real spirit of trail there's a uh, the thing back there i forgot what it was called it's a, it's a space anchor i don't know why that sounds funny place still hasn't been corroded. does that mean the i should hold on have already made it here. i fear the stellaron may be exerting a significant the bird so I should switch characters to Asta because she has fire and I'm assuming that that the uh the people we have to fight here will probably uh only have ice powers because that that would make sense. Do I switch? Oh right here. Well I'm gonna keep uh a lifeline. I'm gonna to keep return. March 7. Cause I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. It's too late to repent. A guest 
Just with no manners, huh? Look out. Oh, she has like a, a staff. He has like a gun. Or something. Reach the end of the story in your own way. It's a weird plant. Defeat enemies to obtain general materials. Oh, I thought I was supposed to hit it. Oh, you can challenge it. That that's our strong enemies. See Asta's like ability and stuff. The stars will always remember us. Huh? Did you see that? I think something's moving. Is it like a pom pom? The pom pom species. Snowdrift. Are you sure you're not seeing things? I don't know. I might be a rock. Hey, get out of there or you'll shiver to death. Holding your breath won't help. I got this, March. Uh, someone's got their head stuck in the sand. Or the snow, in this case. You just need a helping hand. Ouch! What did he do to him? Oh. My fine fellow, was that really necessary? <laughs> Is crawling around in the snow a crime these days? I mean, come on, surely. It doesn't work. But you are hiding. I don't know about that one. But then again, how can I blame you? I mean, I caught you off guard. It, it had to happen. You could even say I deserved it, huh? Besides, I made a gallant group of new friends as a result. <laughs> Is Captain Jafard around? Uh, he, he's an old buddy of mine. Well, who is this guy? Who? Wait, you're not Silvermane Guards? Well, why didn't you say so? Turns out we're on the same side after all. Pleasure to meet you. The name's Sampo Koski. Uh. Excellent. I'll remember the name. Never thought I'd run into friends from the same line of work out here in this frozen wasteland. <sighs> Business is bad these days, but fear not. Sampo Koski isn't interested in hoarding. There's more than enough treasure to go around, so let's get rich together. <laughs> Say, why don't we join forces? I have reliable intel. The main well, who are these guards? The silver main guard is being deployed to the front line. This is a golden opportunity. Yeah, what are you, what are you talking about? What is he talking about? He's he's talking about guards and Then again, I know the rules. Vigilance is the name of the game in our profession. It's my fault for letting my enthusiasm and sincerity get the better of me. Anyway, a meeting like this has to have been written in the stars. Ask me anything you like. I won't skimp on the details. Still make it snappy. You're never more than 10 feet from a silver main guard. C 
Settlement? What a literary turn of phrase. Why, there's only one place in this world where the living still reside. Our beloved Bellabog. The Bellabog. The get, the dicier things become. The city of preservation. The towering citadel. Humanity's last bastion against the eternal freeze. It may sound a bit over the top, but those names are grounded in truth. The only place humans can eke out an existence is behind those impregnable walls. Yeah, why are you hiding? You guys scared me to death. There I was, looking for relics to sell, when all of a sudden you came stomping over. I thought the Silvermane guards were paying me a visit. Seriously, though? Try treading a little lighter next time, huh? If you run into the guards, they won't hide in a snowdrift, and you'll be in a cell before you what, know what's, What are these guards doing? You really don't know? The Bellabog. guards are Bellabog soldiers, enforcers, and police. Let's just say they're not the most flexible of people. And they like paying visits to folks in our line of work. Oh, what is our line of work? Seems like you guys really are new to the business. <laughs> the young and naive again. How about this? As a senior in the field, which I'm sure you don't mind me saying, I'll give you some free guidance. There are ways of doing things in this profession, and you better get familiar with them. Moving in the shadows, finding the goods, pricing your stock, hiding from the guards. There's an art to all of it. What, what are we doing? Oh, wait, he's stealing. No need. Why don't you just take us to the city? We don't really know the way. The city? Already? They haven't even started trading yet. Well, showing you the way is easy enough, Missy, but it would cause... Hey, okay, you're the one that's hiding in the snow, or I can call the guards and they'll be on your ass. But, but it would be my pleasure. Kindness is Sampo Kosti's middle name. Follow me, friends, and uh, keep quiet. We don't want to be spotted by the guards. So why were you hiding from the Silvermane guards? Yeah, we're just storing a few relics away from prying eyes. Nothing serious. If a guy. the uncompromising nature of our civil service, then there'd be no need for secrets. So where about you guys from, anyway? I don't mean to pry or anything. I just care about my friends. No pressure. Space anchor. Oh, think I have to follow. Computerized. Helps me throw off pursuers in no time. <laughs> They're right in front of those, aren't they? Oh, <laughs> hey, why would he? Oh, they are. Who are they? Uh, I think it's the guards. The Silvermane guards I mentioned. That's yeah. them. Help me, old friends. I don't want to be caught. It's the suspect and his accomplices. A point. Arrest them. We just got here. It's now or never. <laughs> Over to you, dear friends. Hey, where do you think you're? Why he's running? Now we're getting in trouble with the guards, and we didn't even mean to. <laughs> A gift from the stars. My turn. Oh, wait, why am I going again? Oh, wait, I used my my ability. Never mind. I was distracted. This is our chance. Oh, uh, yeah, he died. Oh, they have they have guns. I thought they were all holding Never heard of it. the axes. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This century. It's but a vision. If I, if I had a hemocode, she would be 
destroying all these guys with her her drone. Rules are made to be broken. Oh, I can get all three of them. I thought it was only two. For some reason, I thought it was only two. Oh, it's 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 it's, it's somebody with authority. like an officer okay maybe i thought he was gonna be a special oh he is a special character it's gapard i don't think so oh yeah sampo really did this to us <laughs> Put it on him. He, he has uh, the least up or most damage done to him. Oh. I can I can give multiple characters defense, and they're blocking onto me or onto uh, March. I, I think I only have to get um Gerb hard out because these guys are gonna keep spawning but uh, I'm gonna focus most of my attacks on him give her self-defense How my whole like character see. thing is having a bat and not like a, a different weapon, just using a baseball bat. You think they play like space baseball or something? They can't they can't do anything to her. Let's go. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Oh, they're targeting Asta. I think Asta is only good for um having a uh, fire person. I don't think her attacks are that good. Oh, 
Oh, he and then he recovers. Okay, maybe. Hey, you're only supposed to be targeting Asta. What is he doing? And the prime suspect, the one with the blue hair. Apologies, Captain. We lost him during the pursuit. We can't find his footprints. <sighs> no matter. We have his account. Well, we didn't lose. He'll be close by, plotting his next move. <laughs> Never team up with someone like him. I'm not trying to talk our way out of this, but we're not friends with that scoundrel. Did you see how fast he ditched us? We rescued him from the snow out of the kindness of our hearts. We had no idea he might be using us to get past you. Are you really dumb enough to fall for his? I'm a captain, not an adjudication panel. As a Bellabog citizen, you have the right Bellabog. to defend yourself. But that can only take place oh, have to go to court of the architects not now take them away no we're really going to court but we're not from Bellabog. <laughs> photos ah you're a genius great idea you've probably never seen what your planet looks like right I took this one. Behold, Yarilo Six. She shows him a you picture. This white ball that's here. <laughs> that's our home. How what do you that... What do you mean? Look around. It is said that a long time ago, strange visitors from beyond the sky would visit us here, but that after the eternal freeze, the blizzards made passage impossible. And Bellabog would cease to witness such arrivals. But these people are... This decision is beyond us. If what they say is true, then only the Supreme Guardian may decide their fate. Our job is to present them before her. Nothing more. Outsiders, follow me. Bellabog lies beyond this blizzard. Welcome to Bellabog, the city of preservation. Oh, most of I can't even see it. I thought the first city we were going to visit was going to be one not in the snow. That's because you're in Bellabog, the last bastion of humanity. On this planet. Last bastion? <laughs> 700 years ago, monsters from beyond the sky set the world ablaze. The land was turned to scorched earth, with raging infernos and billowing towers of smoke stretching beyond the horizon. In the midst of the conflict, the eternal freeze descended without warning. Suddenly, sweeping winds brought blizzards which buried the invading legion. Bellabog was all that remained. The steadfast architects built this city. Under the protection of Klipoth, the preservation, Bellabog remains forever warm in the face of unrelenting cold. He's sure saying some weird stuff. Remarked the change in tone. It sounds like he's quoting from a historical record. Uh-huh. So why is he telling us all this? You wanted to know. Uh. <laughs> Bam. Well, all she said was it got warmer and then. <laughs> okay. We saw strange creatures outside the city. They must have come from a Terran corroded space. A the kid. <laughs> You. That's right. 
Out there in the blizzard, there are still many threats, including the monsters you saw. The silver main guards are continuously in. Yeah, I don't really care. Can I get? Rita is also ice. I don't want. Oh, I want lightning. Aged with the enemy, but I'm afraid the situation is bleak. After your meeting with the Supreme Guardian, I would like to consult you on this matter. We're lacking in intel. Okay, is this it? Oh, I have to talk to him. We're here. This is Klepoth Fort, the heart of Bellabog and headquarters of the Architects. Klepoth is the symbol of preservation. Under Klepoth's impulsion, the Architects constructed Bellabog, thus protecting the spark of civilization Bellabog. from disaster and the eternal freeze. To show our reverence, we named this fortress after the Eon themselves. The architects, under the protection of Klepoth, have continued to lead this city forward, repelling all manner of disasters. This fortress is also the residence of the Supreme Guardian. The Supreme Guardian? The leader of Bellabog, elected and appointed by the architects. The Supreme Guardians have watched over this city for generations, sheltering the people from harm. The current guardian is Madame Kakolia Rand. Every major strategic decision is issued by her. Oh, she sounds like a big deal. I will now bring you to see Madame Kakolia. Please have your words at the ready. Her time is precious, so she prefers concise communication. Uh, we're gonna see her right now? Can I at least find a place to freshen up first? Is there any etiquette? Let's not waste time. No one will notice. I've dispatched a messenger to send word. Madame Kakolia will be aware of your arrival. Come with me. Oh, I'm gonna go up all those stairs. A lot of stairs. But that's a meaningless sacrifice. How can you... <clears throat> you may leave, Branya. Visitors have arrived. Although I already know her name. Uh, yes, mother. Madam Guardian, I have brought three outsiders to see you. The messenger informed me. Well done, Jepard. You may leave. Welcome, visitors from beyond the Eternal Freeze. Or perhaps I should say... From beyond the sky, no? <laughs> I am Kakolia Rand, Bellabog's supreme guardian. Bellabog. <laughs> I would be grateful if you could tell me why you have come. <laughs> Do you wish me to doubt it? Or perhaps you're not confident in that identity yourself. Well, I just, like, <laughs> woke up, like, a day ago or something. No, I do not doubt it. I can see that you are not from this world. The architects planet. remember the history well, else we should forget it. I know that in the distant past, before the Eternal Freeze descended or the Legion invaded, this world was once prosperous beyond measure. An eon connected our planet to other worlds, and we discovered the endless possibilities of the boundless universe. We also came to know of Klepoth, the Amber Lord. Under their attentive gaze, we built the city walls. So do not be surprised. For 700 years, the Architects have received no further communication from the stars. But I knew of your existence. Tell me why you have come. There's a Stellaron. Yeah, we're trailblazers. Uh, do you think anyone's gonna know what you're talking about? We came here for something known as a Stellaron. A Stellaron? Objects that fell from the blue on separate worlds. Their appearance spelled disaster. Many of the planets we visited have suffered their effects. You mentioned invasion by the Antimatter Legion. Soon after their arrival, this planet suffered the eternal freeze. 
at the same time, the phenomenon known as fragmentum space corrosion began to occur. Correct? Correct. But there's a lot of a lot of things to say. Celerons bring about different disasters on different worlds. But every world seeded with a Celeron will give birth to fragmentums. You can see us as kind-hearted interstellar public servants, lending a helping hand to any world affected by a Celeron. <laughs> Your analysis of our current circumstances is clear. We have indeed suffered the disasters you speak of, some of which prove vexatious to us even today. But why should you care? Because I want it. Even if this Stellaron you speak of did bring about disaster, I fail to see its connection to you. Also, you, you want to keep this eternal freeze. Lengths to help a world unrelated to them, unless they had something to gain. You're right. <laughs> Our reason for coming here is not purely selfless. If we don't seal the Stellaron. We cannot leave this planet. If we can get rid of it, your world will be safer too. You know how to seal the Stellaron. We have the relevant means. Very well, I believe you. If our present situation is truly the result of this so-called Stellaron, then your arrival is the hope that Bellabog has waited 700 years Bellabog. I am willing to assist you in any way possible to help you locate the Stellaron. It's getting late, and you must be tired. I will arrange for you to stay in our most comfortable hotel. Rest there and get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow at noon, I will dispatch someone to escort you here. And we can discuss this urgent matter in greater detail. Yeah, I want to look around. We just got here, and we have to fight your guards. Course. You are Bellabog's honored guests, and have the highest privileges afforded to you. I too need some time. I will go over our records for anything that may be connected to Stellarons. Please excuse me for not escorting you further. Whoa, whoa, what, what did I do that for? Understand. Do not worry. I have a way. I think I think the the hotel thing was the I don't know. I don't know. It seems that the Supreme Guardian holds you in high She regard. might be a bad guy. I have received orders that your movements are no longer to be restricted. She is the big shot. Definitely got that queen of the castle vibe going on. Oh, so cool. <laughs> I'm afraid I still have duties to attend to. I must return to my post. I hope you enjoy your stay in Bellabog. Uh, wait! Can you recommend some sites? It's not that late. We want to take a look around. Well, I'd say that Golden Theater and the History Museum are both worth a look. However, you'd need a pass to get into the museum. I recommend you visit Everwinter Monument first. It's Bellabog's most symbolic landmark. And if you enjoy music, you could head to Neverwinter Workshop. You can sometimes catch an outdoor performance there. The artist is... <sighs> You'll see. Oh, and if you're staying at Goethe Hotel, please avoid the alley Goethe. that runs next to it. The one with Silvermane guards stationed there. It started to be affected by corrosion recently, so it's been sealed off. Got a bunch of barbed wire around it. So the corrosion is inside the city. Well, that's a grave situation. Yes, we're mounting a resistance as we speak. I must leave now. I hope all goes well for you. Okay. Look at this. There's a bunch of children. Oh, it's the girl from the tutorial, I think. Or not the tutorial, like the challenge thing. Whatever it's made of, it can't be ice. Children over there. Should we go and take a look? 
So let me introduce myself. I'm the intelligence officer. Oh, she's a guard. Guards, and a temporary guide for the A Journey Through Bellabog's History program. My name is Pelageya Sergeyevna. That has a long name. But you can call me Pela. Never mind. <laughs> What? What? <laughs> okay, guys, take a look over here. This is Everwinter Monument. It was erected to commemorate the mighty architects. The architects are followers of the Eon Clipod. It was they that foresaw crisis, built up our walls, and established Balabod, preserving the spark of human civilization. Even today, Winter Monument is made up of two parts. A gear that symbolizes knowledge and industrial strength, and huge ice crystals that symbolize the eternal freeze. These two symbols are bound together, the gear restricting the ice. It represents the unyielding spirit of the architects in the face of nature's barbarity. Any questions? Okay, uh, uh, I know a fool what that thing is about or whatever. Never winter workshop. Hey, didn't Japard say there'd be a show here? He said you can sometimes catch an outdoor performance. Sometimes being the operative word. Oh, darn, I wanted to see one. Oh, I'd been wondering, you see that theater over there? Why do they keep it outdoors? This city is so weird. Maybe it's because it's cold. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna say that. That was one of my options. No use against the Stellaron disaster. <laughs> you guys sure have a lot to say about that broken heater. Oh wow. Oh She's I have her. She's in my party. Yep, touch it and find out. Ice cold. I was just about to fix it up. I forgot to introduce myself. The name's Serval. I'm the owner of this workshop. If you got any broken equipment lying around, you can always come find me. Though I can't guarantee I'll be interested in fixing it. Oh, uh, we're okay. I was just curious about the heater. Curious? About the heater? It's just a standard Geomero radiator. You can find them anywhere in the administrative district. Oh, there's not a heater. Only just got here? Figured it out. I heard a loudmouth guard say that a group of outsiders had met with Cocolia. You must be them? What an honor. Where are my manners? We can talk about heaters all day. Let's talk about night. heaters. Let's have a chat. Please make an appointment if you're ready to have. We make a point if you already have an appointment while well, I'm on break so you can get my number and wait until you're cold. It's expected to be your turn in an hour. There's always so many things to think about. Uh... Okay, what's in this trash can? There's, there's got to be something in there. What? What is that? In hidden mission?
Oh, I'm not even supposed to go through the trash. Okay. I got whatever was in the trash can. I don't know what that is. What is that? Events. Oh, it's like a recording or whatever. Not the recording, a uh, event thing. Okay, I'm actually gonna end the stream. <laughs> so it's getting late. So, uh, you know, good morning, good afternoon, good night. Bye bye.